what's going on it's your boy inspiration is key i'm coming at y'all with a video today hoping y'all having a good day you see why i'm at connected with the source energy it feels so good i got the sun you know hitting me it's a nice day you know what i'm saying i get to breathe in that fresh air let me just <sighs> get uplifted because it feels so good i hope you've been taking care of yourself you know what i'm saying Going on that journey within, staying true, remaining humble, remaining authentic, you know, remaining pure, continue to take that time out for self, congregating with like-minded individuals, meditating, manifesting, co-creating, and just becoming your greatest version each and every single day. I'm sending you good energy. Now today, today we're gonna be talking about how to attract abundance and prosperity into your own life now the first thing when it comes to attracting abundance and prosperity into your own life you must feel that you are abundant and prosperous within you must feel this within because when we are the vibrational match of what we aspire to attract it will manifest that's just the law of the universe. That's law of attraction. So if we can embody the vibration of abundance and prosperity, then that will come into our lives. But we have to do the inner work. We have to feel that way each and every single day. You know, even if you even if you necessarily don't have, for instance, the money that you aspire to have wake up every day as if you were already rich wake up with that abundant mindset wake up feeling like you know what i'm saying you could buy everything it's a mindset first once you establish that mindset the universe will send you back that same energy that abundant energy that prosperous energy and then you will in turn manifest abundance and prosperity. Now, the other thing to attracting abundance and prosperity into your life is to actually be doing things that are attracting abundance and prosperity. People don't understand the importance of giving back to, to the world. That's how you really manifest abundance and prosperity. Yes. You know, you can work on something and dedicate your time and energy to making, you know, something come into fruition as far as a goal, a lifestyle. But the real abundance and prosperity comes when you give back to those around you. Because when you give, the universe is going to give to you. Remember, we live in an energy-based world. What we put in is what we will get out. So... If you are, you know, contributing to a cause bigger than self and, you know, remaining selfless and just giving back to the universe, the universe will reward you. The universe will reward you and send you all the abundance and prosperity that you need. And lastly, how to attract abundance and prosperity. It's to live in your truth. It's to live in your truth. The universe rewards those who live in their truth. That's why I come on here every day stressing. Find out who you are. Figure out your purpose. Establish that relationship with self. Because when you do that, you then learn who you are. You learn your authenticity. And your authenticity is your purpose. And when you step in your purpose, you know, you're stepping into who you really are. And the universe gives to those who embrace that. So that's why it's so important that, you know, you dedicate that time to figure out who you are. Build yourself up. You know what I'm saying? Learn more each and every single day and tap in. Tap in. So that you can attract that abundance, that you can attract that prosperity, 
and that you could get uplifted every single day. You know what I'm saying? You see how the sun hitting me? You know what I'm saying? I feel good right now. I'm feeling good. Let me get uplifted because it feels so good. You know what I'm saying? So those are the three steps one should take to attract abundance and prosperity into their life. Live in your purpose, give back, and embody the vibration of abundance and prosperity. You gotta feel that way within. You know what I'm saying? Even like, I'm gonna give another example. Even when you go to like the store or something, let's say you don't have the money for a particular item. And subconsciously, you're going to say, man, there's no way that I'll ever be able to afford that. But instead of allowing that thought to come, be aware of that thought and say, you know what? One day I'll be able to buy that. One day I'll be able to achieve that. One day I will be able to get that. Never count yourself out. That's another way that we cut up, cut off our abundance and prosperity is when we limit ourselves, limit our beliefs, limit what we can have. You got to believe that you can achieve the limitless, unlimited, you know what I'm saying? Unlimited abundance and prosperity. And when we do that, we can change our lives for the better and in turn live our best life. You know what I'm saying? So let me get uplifted one more time because it feels so good. Let me get uplifted because it feels so good. You know what I'm saying? Please like and share the vid. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. Follow me on Instagram at official inspiration is key. Add me on Snapchat at inspiration is K. You know what I'm saying? Go get uplifted on the website at official inspiration is And it's your boy, man. You know what I'm saying? I got the sun just, you feel me? It's your boy. Inspiration is what? What? Key, baby.